So when you're running comparisons in JavaScript between multiple values, we have double equals and triple equals. Both of these are comparison operators, but there is a difference between them. The double means comparing values, and the triple equal sign mean comparing object equality. There's the negative version, which is a single exclamation mark, and this. So here we're saying, are the two values the same? Here we're saying, are the two values not the same? Here we're saying, are the two things we're comparing the same object? Here we're saying, are they not the same object? So I want to run through a few examples here. We're going to look at a couple of uh, primitive types, so using numbers and comparing those with double and single, or sorry, double and triple equal signs. We're going to look at comparing objects. We're going to look at comparing two copies of the same object, and then we're going to look at extracting two pieces of HTML into two different variables and comparing those. So we'll start with the primitives. We want to look at if A is the same value as B. And we'll write out A, B, R, double equal. Else console.log A and B are not equal. the same thing as this, but I'm going to use the triple equal sign. Okay, just comparing the primitives, uh, jumping into here, run this page. So they are double equal and they are triple equal. That means that the primitive values, five, they're put into two different variables, but the value of the variables are the same, and they both point to the exact same object. So 5 and 5. The number 5 is the same regardless. So it is the same object. Now, dealing with objects, if we copy all this, come down here, we're going to compare object 1 to object 2 with the double and the triple. So we take that, and we'll change our console log statements as well. There we go. Come back in here, run it. And they're neither double nor triple equal. So although they are set to something that looks the same, they are two different objects. Because they're two different objects, they are not the same. They will not give us inequality. Triple equal, are they the same object? Well, absolutely not. They're obviously two separate objects. We've created them on two different lines. We've assigned them to different variables. So double and triple, neither one. So we, here we got a yes for this one, we got a yes for this one, and here we got the answer, and here we got the answer. All right, now let's jump down to the next one. What if we take two copies of the same thing? Both copy one and copy two are pointing to the exact same variable. So we'll put copy one in here for all of these. And then copy two. And we don't know the answer yet, so we'll remove that. Okay, so copy one, copy two, two variables pointing to the same object. Let's see what we get. Double and triple equal. Okay, so object one is inside of copy one. Object one is also inside copy two. So when you compare them, they are equivalent. They are the same object. Because they are the same object, we get the triple. And if you get the triple, you're going to get the double. They have the same value. They have to have the same value 
because they are the same object. So this is a yes, and this is a yes. All right, now down to our final example here. What if you've got a couple of pieces of HTML? And this is really the reason I'm running this in the browser instead of in the terminal. I want to compare what happens if we grab the same piece of HTML, we hold that in two different variables. Well, since we got the triple equals on the last example, it would stand to reason that we're going to get it again with this one, because we are making two variables which point to the same object. It is the same piece of HTML on the page. It's not two different h1 tags, it is two pointers to the same HTML tag. Run that, and there we go. HTML 1 and 2, which both point to the same thing, are triple and double equal. So that's the difference between the double and the triple. If you were just comparing values, and you're talking about primitives, booleans, strings, numbers, they're going to be double, and they're going to be triple equal. If you are creating two different objects, even though they look the same, if they are in fact two different objects, you'll get neither one, double nor triple. If the variables are both pointing to the exact same object, yes, you're going to get the triple equal and the double equal. And if you're pointing to the same piece of HTML, you will get the triple and the double equal as well. So that is the double and the triple equal sign. And there's also the, the negative, oops, sorry, that should just be two equal sign after the exclamation mark. All right, thanks for watching. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments.